scoring strikes in there. It's a big situation. You can understand it. Maldonado wants the hook. Three and two the count. And he lays off and look at Diaz. They ask for appeal. No, and Diaz is barking at Valdez. And that was just full on competitive nature of these two. And Diaz took that breaking ball and started chirping at it like Juan Soto. It was almost like he was yelling at him for not challenging him uh, on the 3-2 pitch. I agree, because he took it. You see, he took like a step forward, looked at him. Well, the, <laughs> the, the mediator there was Carlos Correa. Yeah. Of all people. Fully engaged, man. We talked about it at the beginning. And look at Carlos Correa. Now, he is in a serious pep talk with Framber Valdez, and that has everything to do with don't let these guys talk to you that way. You show them. Yeah, that away. Leader. That is a leader. Well, there comes a rare visit from Brent Strom, the pitching coach. He'll try to calm down Valdez. You ever seen that? I haven't seen that too much. I, I, I haven't seen that in a Just long Soto, time. You know, it's competitive at bat. You take a pitch and you start barking. He's in it, man. Look at it. Look. Oh. <laughs> Maldonado's chirping. I know enough Spanish to understand what he just said. So Diaz from Cuba, Maldonado from Puerto Rico, and Framber Valdez from the Dominican Republic. And they they are all in it. Maldonado saying, look, it's okay, amigo. Go to first. I don't think it's okay. <laughs> I would tell him just to go to first. With that being said, you would have liked to have seen Valdez challenge him there and try to get a ground ball on that sinking fastball. And this, probably the best disciplined guy on that team is Yandy Diaz. That's his.